So once they heat for three minutes, they are half cooked. Okay, so you are ready. Then you strain off the water. Once you strain off the water, what I want you to do is that you use a spoon. Okay, you put in some of the butter. And a little bit of your seasoning. Okay. And you toss them together. Once the butter is melted, you put the potatoes in. Okay. Okay. Then you put it into the oven for 200 degree and 15 minutes. Then the next thing, I want you to use the same pot. Okay. Don't wash because the butter is inside and the seasoning is inside. Okay. What I need you to do is that you heat it up again, you put in your French bean. Okay. Just stir that. The type of cooking for a chef is normally we try not to wash the pot as much. Reason why? Because the flavor of the pot is there. So that we can actually reuse and take the flavor from the pot. And I need you to add in a little bit of water. Just a little bit. Once we have done this, okay, we put aside. We put it up. Okay, next, all the ingredients left over tomatoes, coriander, basil, and garlic. Cut. Okay, then the leftover butter. What we're going to do now, when the frying pan is just heating up, it's not 100% hot yet, we need to put the butter in because I do not want to put it when it's too hot. When it's too hot, it intends to burn the butter instead of melt the butter. Okay, so once the butter is start to melt, we put in the garlic. Okay, so when the garlic starts to smell good, the butter starts to melt, we put in the chicken. Not too high heat. Okay, because you are using butter. Remember this. Not 
Okay, by this, huh? You move it all around. Put them well. Once you seal the chicken, what you need to do is put everything in. As you can smell, Well, there's a lot of fight of cooking for this dish all right some of them they use olive oil extra virgin olive oil it's up to you if you like it so but i prefer to use butter because a little bit of butter smell gives up the flavor to bring out the color of the chicken. Once the chicken has the color, the white wine, right? And just pour it in. Everything right. Okay. And mix. Put everything for the white wine. Off the fire. And there you go. Put the chicken. Put the chicken in a tray with a baking paper. Alright. Now put everything on top. Stand by your cheese. cheese, a lot of parmesan cheese, All right, and there you go, put in the oven, okay, 15 minutes, 200 degrees. Okay, when it comes to 12 minutes, so left three minutes to go. We put in the potatoes. Just now we take it out, 12 minutes. Reason why is because we need to reheat everything. Okay, we need to reheat everything. So what I'm going to do is that I will put everything into this dish because there are still three minutes to go. <clears throat> Okay, then three minutes to go. So we put some seasoning on top just to make it more flavorful. Okay, not too much. You do not want to over season it. Then we put it back into the oven. Okay, put it back into oven for three minutes. Okay, so we put in the oven for the extra three minutes. So 12 minutes, you bring out you put everything in and a little bit of seasoning then you put inside another three minutes so now it's all done okay we got to plate this okay so what i'm going to do is then put all the potatoes on the side right the french pin How beautiful the color is. Just nice. Okay, we're gonna put this chicken on here. And then the side. Okay. 
and these are the juice. Don't waste. You can pour on top. 